How many prisoners had corporal punishment used on them growing up? I don't know the complete answer to this question, and I can only speak from my experiences and the ones fellow prisoners have shared with me. I grew up in a house where you got spanked for breaking the rules. A lot of my friends in here share the same experience. But, I'm sure many people in the free world were also spanked growing up. I believe a correlation between spanking and coming to prison probably does exist. However, to conclude that spanking leads to prison, I believe, would be a hasty observation. There are several reasons why I am against spanking and I will use my own experiences to explain them. Growing up, I knew when I did something wrong and I was going to get a spanking. But, knowing something is wrong and understanding exactly why it is wrong are two different things. Spanking made me painfully aware I had messed up. What I should have been made aware of is why what I did was wrong. This understanding cannot be given to a child when all they can think about is the pain they are being handed by someone they love. One of the consequences that came for me was I began to question love and what it really was. Another consequence of spanking for me was I began to try and hide everything from my parents. Why discuss and be open and honest about your mistakes if you are just going to get spanked? This made me a deceptive child. I began to hide my emotions and feelings from everyone, and this suppression was not healthy for me. I not only felt nobody loved me, I began to feel like I could not love anybody. I was really confused. Another thing I became confused about as a result of spanking was how effective violence was. I began to view violence as the ultimate problem solver. I used violence to communicate instead of words. I was never extremely violent, but when my emotions were riding high, I saw violence as a solution to deal with them. Then when I got locked up for an extremely violent act, I observed everyone around me had the same answer to their problems. Only it has never really been an ultimate solution to my problems. Violence has only been a way to change the situation I find myself in. It has always made my problems worse in the long run, but it took me many years to see that. Spanking created a perfect storm in my life. For that reason, I would never spank my children. I don't want to blame all of my problems in life on the fact that I was spanked. Spanking was just a contributing factor to these problems. Like I said, not everyone who was spanked as a child ends up in prison. But, when I sit down and really think about it I cannot find one positive aspect in my life that spanking me as a child led to. That speaks volumes to me. All communications between inmates and external channels are facilitated by approved volunteers since inmates do not have access to the internet. This program with Quora is part of the last mile, Sam Quinton. Twitter at TLM 